Hey guys, how's it going? Kaprain here. Today I want to bring you guys some footage of my adventures playing around with the Hunter Quest. Hunter Quest is the one where you gotta play seven one-drops, and there's actually a few challenges to this because you have to balance out actually having a ton of one-drops, as well as having some kind of like redraw siphoning engine, something like that. It's a bit tricky. It seems that uh, we kind of uh, underestimated this card in terms of how complex it might actually be to build and play that that type of deck. You can't just play 31 drops. You're not going to do very well if you do that. And uh, overall, I've been uh, probably most impressed by this quest than any other. One of the big decks right now is the Midrange Hunter. It doesn't include the quest. A lot of people are playing those type of decks, but actually very few are playing the quest hunters. And I thought I'd give you guys my take on it. I think I'm uh, running a few interesting reload mechanics that uh, I think work pretty well. And uh, maybe you can be inspired to check out the quest hunter if you have the quest at least uh, for yourselves. So uh, check out the clips. Hope you enjoyed them. Hope you learned something. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh crap, that's bad. That's a problem. Uh, I think just that is fine right now. Snipe. All right, we need two one drops. Side effects. No. Trust me. If I get a one drop next turn, it's probably good enough. Holy crap. Most of those are going to suck. I haven't done discard lock now.
That's pretty good. Full reload. It's got a Nova or something, I guess. Oh, second board clear. Oh, I don't know about that, bro. It's a little early. Try to go to forty. Tartola preserve us. The game begins. Tartola preserve us. It's pretty nasty. Get in there and fight, maggot. Okay, so he has to Amara. You are safe now. I don't know how safe he's gonna be. I think I can get through that. Oh wow. Okay. We gotta go quick here. Um Okay, that was that was an extremely crappy turn. Does he have Nazoth? Oh, he doesn't have Nazoth.
think that was okay. Ah, uh, alright. I'm almost out of cards. Well, looks like we got him. Go. One there. One there. One there. Peace out. That was a very, very weird game. <laughs> Maybe I should mulligan everything for, uh... Happy New Year! Kind of just mulling and everything for like Igneous and Firefly. Those are the two most important cards, I think. get a firefly I can play the queen on curve which is insane good enough for me That's so bad. I can't activate next turn. Corehound? What? No, I don't think that's a good idea. Shitty heifer. An incredible discovery. Let's just call him a pretty shitty heifer. I don't think it's like all the way shitty. Am I really one off? What the fuck? Does freeze Doom Sarah win the game? The end is coming. I needed the space on the board. This is really good. I think I have to keep that.
Play around Harrison or something, I don't understand. Glacial Shard can buy me a turn against the an activated quest. You like my invention. I like the whack weather as Canadians are having. Yeah, that's pretty interesting. Don't go outside very much, so it's quite all right. I don't want to draw. I actually, I want to draw one drop. I don't want to have to play this, but yeah, I play that if I have to, and it looks like I have to. Not bad. 